idea of the first program was to offer food to those in need and wealth, never to do any means testing. So anyone that walks in the door will receive food. Um, they wanted to do this out of respect and dignity for the people that we serve. And here we are all these years later, um, we're almost 20 years in business, and we have three pantries in two locations. We run cafes on Monday and Tuesday mornings, and we also offer free clothing, household items, and refreshments at all of our pantry uh, events. There are also um, shelters that mandate that people have to be out by a certain time in the morning, usually 8 a.m. They cannot return until 4 p.m. So those people need to find a place to go with something to do. Um, people that are trying to get sober and, and lose their addictions need a safe place to go where they won't be harassed by people that are still using. This program is not an expensive program. Um, all we're really looking to order is coffee, snacks. We try and provide nutritious snacks as well. So you'll see that we have sweet treats out there, but we also try and provide sandwiches and oatmeal in the winter. Sometimes in the summer we offer freezies and ice cream. So we want to have something that is, is nutritious but also something that the guests are going to enjoy when they come in here. And that money helps us fund that little bit of food that we need to purchase. Now, um, our food budget this year is $75,000. Three years ago, it was only $40,000. And um, since that time, we have changed our model from serving individual adults to serving families. And we've had a huge explosion in the number of people that can access our services. cost of food continues to rise and we have a mandate to serve the most nutritious food possible so we have a dietitian that looks at what we're offering for two to three days of food and she tells us how much the quantity and the quality of the food that we need to provide so we're not providing too many carbs versus uh, versus protein we try and balance everything out and uh, we have a real focus on fresh fruit and vegetables dairy and eggs I love the um the way the community comes in to our programs and they enjoy them, they get help, they get, um, you know, lead it to other places where there's other help for them in different areas and it's just an excellent, excellent programming. Nice to see the street people have a place to go in the mornings. Mm -hmm. for yeah. a bite to eat and some chit chat and um, see so more chit chat with things us. like that. I would say a deep bit of gratitude for the funds that you'd helped, that you've given us to help provide snacks and a welcoming environment to people who need to be off the street during the day and who want to come in and communicate with familiar faces. Um, the money has gone very far. Like I said, it's an inexpensive program to run and extremely vital in this community. Thank you. Thank you very much.